there, good morning. It's Saturday. It's the fourth Saturday in July. And if you don't know it, it's a, uh, it's cowboy day, national cowboy day. So I thought, uh, I'd start with a cowboy poem, which is called a cowboy song. It looked like just another cowboy song, cows meandering along the fence, sun dropped down and sent colors across the sky with a bit of suspense. Windmills towering in the darkness against pale pink and baby blue. An old style country feeling it was, and I think you might feel it too. I could picture a cowboy on his horse, some cattle bedded down for the night, a couple guitars playing around the fire. What a delight, western sight. Wind picking up just a little bit, the orange flames softly sputtering, Tired horses tied up nearby. You could see their tails a-fluttering. Can't be a more western setting. After a day so tiring and long, strumming those old guitars and singing a cowboy song. That's by Marilyn Loft. And how about some cowboy wisdom? We could all use that. It's better to keep your mouth shut and look stupid than to open it and prove it. Just cause trouble comes a visiting doesn't mean you have to offer it a place to sit down. The quickest way to double your money is to fold it over and put it back in your pocket. And any cowboy can carry a tune. Trouble comes when he tries to unload it, right? Here, I'll give a good example. Home, home on the range. Where the deer, you know I can't play any instrument I own, right? <laughs> where, where the deer and the antelope play. Where seldom is heard and a discouraging word. And the skies are not cloudy all day. It's going to be a great day today up in the mid-80s. Lots of sun, a bit of clouds. Get outside and celebrate the day. I'm out. Bye-bye.